adapt and we're ready to do whatever we have to as the disease spreads, if it spreads. President Trump announcing he's assembled a task force that is ready to respond to the virus amid an escalating global toll and an increasingly urgent international response. As the virus fans out across Asia, Europe and the Middle East, more than 80,000 cases now reported worldwide. In just four months, Olympic athletes from around the world will flood Tokyo for the 2020 Summer Games and there has been a growing concern about what's being done to protect them and the Games. Well, Two Works Fuse Katie Kelleher found some Oklahoma athletes who are being affected by the outbreak. The OU men's gymnastics team is one of the best in the country. Head coach Mark Williams says a couple of his athletes are planning to compete in World Cups in different countries in March, but they're now either rethinking going or being extra cautious if they do. They're definitely reaching out to, to athletes and, um, you know, maybe changing some some plans as to competitions that they can even go to. Japan has 870 confirmed viral cases. The International Olympic Committee says despite concerns from some members, the Tokyo Games will go on as planned. However, the Olympic torch relay, which is supposed to start March 26, could be scaled down. We're proceeding on the basis uh, that that uh, is our default position, uh, that it won't change unless the public authorities, uh, health authorities, uh, make it clear uh, in some binding fashion this can't uh, occur. President Trump announced at a press conference Wednesday that Vice President Mike Pence will lead the U.S. government's response to the coronavirus and pledges to spend whatever is necessary to fight it, saying the country is already taking precautions. So we have been at a very high level screening people coming into the country from infected areas. As the Olympics and other tournaments and championships get closer, Williams says they'll let top organizations make the call on if athletes can travel internationally or not. We forge on trying to, to be prepared to go, um, and I guess we'll find out what happens in the world and how much the coronavirus uh, spreads throughout um, other nations and how much it might affect uh, the Tokyo Olympics. And that was Katie Kelleher reporting for us. Now, the Olympics are set to open on July 24th. The Paralympics opens on August 25th.